Tá moi bini ni skalawi, moi fare ha moi ofo. Tá moi lot moi ateiho, moi ofo ike fonua. Tá moi eik paremia, ono ko atis pohima. Kwa hivyo ni kwa wama mahi moi eik paremia, moi ya yotoa ono ko afanga, ono ko pohima, awani ati. Tá moi eik ni stawa ya ko, ono ko pensi mani fita, moi kamu ni stawa ya kapi. Tak mau tahu gue, kau mau pergi ke area. Tak mau kau CEO, kau tak ngau, mau ulur ngah kau ngau ya perangga. Tak mau fikir kau fikir tui, mau pergi stay di sejak sebulan dia kau tanya nak tonga, fikir kau tui tak ahi. Tak mau pergi stay di sejak sebulan tonga, fikir kau tui tak tui belum katuang. Tak mau fikir kau apa bak tak di sejak sebulan lagi. Tak boleh pada setiap malam lalu saya sebut sekian tawa tanya nak tonga, mesti kau tu kita alfred malakai mon. Tak boleh pada setiap nasi asto kai kolo yang kalah isi, mesti kau tu kita alifah wajah saulala, mesti kau tak lalu tuh nukar to. Tak boleh sekian tadi lah yang siasi, mesti kau nasi asto kolo, baik yang kau mesti kau yang siasi yang nukar to. I would like to gratefully acknowledge the presence of the guest speaker of today's graduation ceremony. Dr. Kenneth Romain, as well as his wife, Mrs. Romain. And as always, Professor Brian Cusick from the Auckland University of Technology. Professor Lee from Guangyu University. Dr. Steve Kuma, Dr. Leibon Mutui, and all the lecturers that are here with us today. Tapu mwe sea mwe kuate pule, mwe mei upa kotoa, mwe kuate pule at University of Kalaisi. Tapu ka sengsta sa ulama mwe kotoa ka ufaya, ka ungawe, mwe university. Tapu mwe kioa mwe takap, mwe fale matapule. Tapu mwe kafuka afi ono ka atoa, mwe ngahi ka ume, mwe university of Kalaisi. Tak mengah, mahu tak fana aku tua pe, tak kau fata ya hon. Tak mahu tong, aku tua pe buat kerja fnahan, ingat pe ya, mengat mu pe. Fata mak eh fok, ke kau mak fai longa, fra aku mi universiti kalai si, ayuh tahu hen, ke fai muka tuanga, memalak ke fia, ke kongkongi. Tala muka pui, engah fra taku, kata ke fra hoko, ke proklama, ke ah mahingai. Kyo, kau nak pangai pangai mali, pangai, kau lagi mali, kau tahu kau, kau tahu kau pak, kau tulak, kau pulak kalama, kau dah hodi, kau tahu kau mata, kau mata kau luar mahui ngak iPhone one, I look, kau pulak kalama, tulak, kau dah hodi, kau hidup kau luar ki, kau tak tak kia, presiden malolo, saya sebut dia tahu tak nak tonga. Mereka kata untuk kita alfred malakai mon. Kita tahu apa tu kita sami, sami tiaw, lawia, mereka kata si mon square, sekitar lah. Saya sekolah kata tanya. Bukan di floor, lawia di sope, untuk kita apa apa, di sope pun saya sekali lagi. Kebal lor, kalau dah hari, faya, mereka kata untuk kita hi, mereka kata lagi. We will now begin today's program, Worshiping Our Lord. And I call upon Reverend Dr. Alfred Mon to lead us in the first hymn. But have you read it out, God, on the Tol Mia, on the Pulmani Mahini? Tol Mani Mahini, Mugna, Gitaweba. Hey, go ahead and off the mic. Kau bela lagi mua, dan alam aku fai, mak aku suah.
Scripture reading for this morning will be given by Bishop Dr. Afabanga of the Church of England. Holy Ghost of Jesus Christ, according to St. John, chapter 15, commence reading from 1 to 5. I am the true wine, and my father is the cardinal. He cuts off every branch in me that bears no fruit, while every branch that does bear fruit, he prunes so that it will be even more fruitful. You are already clean because of the word I have spoken to you. Remain in me. Zai also remain in you. No branch can bear fruit by itself. 
it must remain in the mind. Neither can you bear fruit unless you remain in me. I am the mind. You are the branches. If you remain in me and I in you, you will bear much fruit. Apart from me, you can do nothing. For the wine and money, the word of the mind, the devil will move in. But what I'm going to be here, get down, or we like four, or what they could do with him. The way I'm going to be here, four, or what they all come here, I'll see the eye on the four. Umo maaeli, kerea, uurea, ki, kerek motoro. No fuye teo, mwau ya tek motoro. Ame yo kikai pa fua, ay maa ya te ya pe. O ka pao e kai no fuo, ihe waine. E pehe fopi ak motoro. O ka pao e kai, e mo no fuye teo. Wau ya waine, ay maa hi waa, ak motoro. O yo no fuye teo, mwau ya te ya. Oh yeah, yeah, the fool I hate. But my wife, my wife, is like from five minutes ago. Amen. Tak ada apa-apa yang kau kongkongi, kau tahu kau tak nak kau tak lalu tu. Ia orang wow, bahu ingat kau ya ahon. Ini orang kau pun mesti dah tukai kolor, bahu pun mesti dah tukang kato. Kau kata dia faham siapa siapa. Kau ihel, kau kau tak mahu, faham kau tak kui. And now call upon the Royal Chaplain, the President of the Free Church, Free Wesleyan Church of Tonga, Reverend Dr. Ahio, to lead us in the opening prayer. let us pray. <laughs> My Allah was Jesus Christ, my heart, my mind, and my mood is getting my soul. So my love, my dear man, and he will find out, and my tanky, my father, my father, and he will find out. So my father, my father, and I am the Lord. He will know my photo, and he will find out, and he will find out, and he will find out, and he will find out. So my father, my father, and I am the Lord. Kita tui rumah mak, kau kata yang tua, rumah fahai, kau fol folam, lang lang di, kau afian di rumah kau kais, kau ne fahai dia di rumah tol, ay halam, demoi moni, dia mera kau be, kau mau fahai dia aku, dia mau kau fahai kau sleeping kau leh kau kais, dia mau main kau ni kau aku. Maulahai kepada Hoko, ay sibing ang fagat kalaisi, agar nilita ang mahuilo ko yam, kifay ng naupe si Maulahai. Kung tukupan ang fatongia yung universidad ng kalaisi, ay ang fagat ng maluhi ang tui, mo'y poto, mo'y matuoto ang fagat ng mai, fagat ng mali mo fagat sino? In the name of the Lord, I am the University of Kalaisi. I am the Kalaisi, I am the Kalaisi. I am the Kalaisi, 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 Aya mau faham ni, mau faham faham. Kepuah kelawa mea fahamku, kalau mau faham lah fahamku. Oya hodi, kau yang mea faham, ayo dua, kau kita ya. Ya faham lagi, ini adalah fio kudu bawono, kau itu ya tom. Ya faham ni kiai, ada ini kau ini nasbau. Ai egi minista ya kau mau ya kau ngawe kau mah kau ahi foto fana namai egi minista kandet kau egi fonua kau fanya kau yang mau pule kau universiti ni 
Ramal Magdol, Utopia, Kau Famon, Pefau, and Hon. We got on us for Pareo, or Fayof, or Moyamana. We fight Magad, we fight with our love. We flan, a lot of Gawako, Nana Willow, Motu in your life. In the name of God the Father, who is our provider of wisdom? The Son Jesus Christ, who is our, our only way, the truth and the life. And the Holy Spirit, who is our teacher, guide and inspiration. We thank you God for the knowledge and wisdom which is given so freely and so unconditionally to all humankind. We thank you for the believing that we common people could reflect your glory and honor in the name of Christ who shows us the way and the truth to all things we do in education. And that we may be faithful examples of Christ to the people of this academic world and learn to offer some such examples of Christ with the best of our knowledge to other people in any form of service. This is the commitment and responsibility of Christ University, a triangle components of faith, scholarship, and intellectual maturity for the well-being of this university. Praises and loving God, thank you for this special day. We are gathered here to celebrate the graduation of Christ University. It is also an act of worship to you, O God, in which the achievements of the graduates is signed and both fair the safety of God. Glory be to God. It will be honored by His Majesty King Paul the Sixth, the King of Thailand. It will be witnessed by Her Majesty Queen Minas Babu, Honorable Minister of Education and Training, and Ministers of the Cabinet, Noble of the Ram, visiting scholars, staff and management of the university, and all of us who are here today. It is also a reward of love, hope, faithfulness, sacrifice, and trust which was at the heart of the students who knew and believed in Christ. Grace as God as we celebrate the past and rejoice in, our, in the presence of the Christ University, we also look forward with hopeful heart to you. We pray that you would bless their majesties, our King and our Queen of Tonga, Bless the founder and the vice chancellor of Christ University, Reverend Doctor Yufawaila Salana, staff and management of the university, honorable minister of education and visiting scholars, and all of us who are here today. Especially we ask for your blessing for all that is said and done for this ceremony. May your name be glorified and lifted. <coughs> we thank you and ask this blessing through Christ our Lord, who lives and reigns with you, God the Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, and one God forever and ever. Amen. Amen.
leadership by the fully faithful. From there, my heart by the time. The Allah ya go kya kitum tumu. The Allah yang yes taulat. The Allah yang angat pel tan. Kaya hon Afghan story. For hai, hai tu, for fonua, for buriang, we will see to kalais. I would like to invite the Honourable Minister of Education, Kensman Fit, to formally announce the status of Christ University in Tonga. Tonga, 
It's a real honor and privilege to introduce Professor Brian Cusick from the very beginning. He led the work to establish the University of Christ in Pacific, in Tonga. We can't thank him enough for his tireless effort. And now we have seen the fruit. I would like to call upon Professor Cusick to deliver the welcoming remarks. For Speaking on behalf of the Friends of the University, which is a fraternity of fellowship of professors from all around the world and believers who are supporting Christ University in Pacific. We have professors in Europe and the UK, North America, across the states of Asia, and of course Australasia, and uh, a number of them are here today as representatives of this group. The Friends of Christ University in Pacific are experienced and wise old men and women who have worked in universities for long periods of time and many have retired as Professor Emeritus and they wish to share their experience, their knowledge in a benevolent way to support this university into its current inception and into the future and to support the Kingdom of Tonga in this great educational adventure that you have pushed us out into. So I acknowledge that perhaps I should not be uh, giving the welcome today. On the list of acknowledgements, of course, at the top is God Almighty. And it is remarkable that in a university today, God Almighty, the creator of the heavens and the earth, is welcomed in the University of Asia. And today, here at Christ University, we welcome God Almighty. And as the chaplain has already shared, thank you, sir, uh, this is an act of worship. The graduation ceremony is an act of worship. <coughs> and I think in all of our hearts today, there is an invitation for God Almighty and the Holy Spirit to be part of our occasion in life and learning and sharing together here. So our first welcome, our second, of course, is to Your Majesties. Thank you for gracing this occasion. It's a special day, but you make it even more special. Welcome. And, Chancellor, this is your university. And again, I'm embarrassed welcoming you, but with a warm heart, welcome to the occasion. The nobles of the realm, welcome to the celebration today. The Honourable Prime Minister, Obviously a warm welcome, but condolences this morning to the Prime Minister and to his family. Um, he would have loved to have been here, but family matters, of course, have overtaken events. Welcome to the Ministers. It's good to see you again and to see you here. And I hope you feel welcome at the University. All of you fine people that we've met this morning. The Reverend Doctor 
I heard the chaplain, uh, the royal chaplain, um, thank you for your prayer this morning. Thank you for your connection between the university and the church. Um, I think it's lost in history somewhere, sir, that all the universities started in the churches. Back in the 12th century, the first five European universities were built, which includes the ones in Italy and France and the two in the United Kingdom. All of them came from churches. The churches took responsibility for education of their children and their people, learning of the scriptures, good discipline and morality. And then the churches got to a stage they needed to have higher learning for things like sciences and theology. And they founded the seven pillars of the modern university. And often these seven pillars of learning and theology is one of them, and of course there's sciences and mathematics and languages and so on. These seven pillars came originally from the foundation of church universities. And all of the senior leadership in the original universities were church leaders. So, sir, I thank you very much and welcome you here this morning. I also acknowledge um, the other distinguished church leaders that have prayed and a welcome from the university and a welcome back again when you choose to come back again. Welcome. Members of the diplomatic courts, um, the dignitaries that are present from the different nation state orders that are present in Tonga, welcome. Our guest speaker, uh, the gentleman to my right here, uh, Dr. Kenneth Robbies, come in from the United States of America to share his word, his blessing, and his um, theological ideas with us this morning. Welcome, sir. Welcome to the university. Then there's a very long list of distinguished guests and dignitaries, faculty, staff, and students. Welcome to the Marae. Welcome to Christ University in Pacific. And I would hope that this is a place of meeting, that no matter what the religion, what the belief, that the university can be a place of meeting. It can be a place where there is patience to listen to other people's points of view. There's sufficient intellectual firepower to be able to listen intelligently and contribute faithfully to other people's thoughts. I would hope the university is, as we call in Aotearoa, a marae, a meeting place. A place where people may talk and speak, speak without fear and be listened to be listened to by colleagues and others in a sensitive, a constructive, and an upbuilding way. In the walk of this morning, we've crossed many divides. From royalty to politics, from religion to the university. I would hope you all feel very welcome this morning. I would hope that this is a marae where we may all share and fellowship together. And of course, in Christ's presence, that we may be joined together. That is the welcome. Um, I was then to go, told to go on and speak for at least an hour <laughs> on very important matters that we should all be concerned about. You will let me do that? <laughs> oh, my page is missing. I'll have to have the shortened version. I apologize. I do need to turn for a moment to the occasion. This is the most important occasion in university life. It is the graduation, and as we've already heard, it is an act of worship. But this is the graduation where those who have completed their work are recognized and they receive their parchments. They will hang on their walls and it will promote them through the industries and the employment that they go to. It is a very important occasion. So first and foremost, in terms of celebration, we are celebrating our graduates. Secondly, thank you, Mr. Minister of Education. Christ University in Pacific is now registered, which means that these degrees and these parchments that are being presented can be taken and transacted 
in other nation states. So this means that they can go to Australia, New Zealand, California, the United Kingdom, hold their heads up and say, here is Christ University in the Pacific Bachelor of Theology, Bachelor of Education. And it will be acceptable within those jurisdictions that the quality procedures have been adhered and that it is an acceptable career. That's something tremendous to celebrate. I truly, truly hope that this is an asset to Tonga. That it's a step into the future. For those folks who don't have the opportunity to travel on scholarships, that Christ University in Pacific may provide the standard of education that in the future they can travel. Thirdly, 40 years of this church, 40 years, a remarkable celebration. I've read some of the histories, some of the thesis recount these histories. And I hope that the path is peaceful. I sincerely hope that in the next 40 years, that as things continue to grow and flourish, and God bless Dr. Lee Bell in his leadership, as things continue to bless and will be blessed as they flourish and grow, that Christ University of Pacific will contribute something that was not here before. It will contribute something where it can be a ladder or a stepping stone for people in their education and personal growth. And they may step into the future together with many others that have graduated from this organisation. And then finally, finally in terms of celebration, and it should really have been first, this is Christmas. This is December and we're all coming into Christmas. Christmas we are celebrating, as we all know, and I don't need to re-say it, but I will re-say it. This is Tonga, you know it so well. But this is Christmas. We celebrate the birth of the Lord Jesus Christ. One of the greatest frailties, difficult circumstances, challenging environments in the Middle East, and the saviour of mankind was birth at this particular time a very large number of years ago. I don't want to get into a debate with a theologian. A very large number of years ago. But Jesus Christ was birthed in frailty, lived a life of service and sacrifice, obeyed his Father in heaven, and gave to us the greatest gift of all time. That is truly something to be celebrated. It's nothing to be hidden away. And I celebrate the church groups, Your Majesty, in Tonga, when I see their parades going down the street at this time of the year. It is fantastic. It is great. It is right to have this kind of celebration at this time of year for a remarkable occasion that transcends all of our lifetimes and provides a gift to all of humanity. So in terms of my welcome, there are a number of other pages here and I've lost some of them, so I can't keep going. In terms of the welcome, please feel warm in your hearts. Please feel strong. Please join with Christ University in Pacific for each of these four celebrations today. And could I say, as by comment and personal way, four of my family members have turned up today as well. So I'm delighted to have them here at Christmas Day. And thank you for the welcome to me. But look, God bless you and have a wonderful family Christmas. And I really need to hand this back to somebody more important at this point in time. Thank you very much.
keu u fanga mua ilai tala fata ko to ape ko osi a faki i he fangai ni a ta ke tia ke fai mo ape haki pramata la no no ke la ve ni ga mo e universit ko ia o ka la si ke fai pe ia i he de a faka to nga uh, the advice uh, chancellor's report can be found in pages 9 to 14 for those the non speakers. Oko fa feta ilahi ke tu o elangi fa ho ko lele o e aho ma inga ko eni ke aku kau fa ka hape. Moi fonua ure anga si asi i he congratulation o e afiona i he tuunga wa ki ai o ma mo university ma o ila i a pito university honga la i a la I he tāli e ho afio ke hoko ko e chancela ke ko e pulelai ko e universiti i he tā uafe ka hao no lolo tonga ia te he ke mau ha paka atā ka me he poate universiti o tonga a mau tumu Falala mai ai afiori o que tá ai firma o mau fanki loto tu ani a de vinha na no lele de hoko o chenchela o universo o uma capo a fundo o neta la capitania you certainly take them as by faith. Ame koya ko fraha e he eight minister oya ko ona ko pensiman fifita aho ko e ni ai loto lele o e ko ate foaki man Sita Kakato, the whole man of the university. Again, congratulations. Congratulations. I may have to pay a fiona, but I do a math master. But I love no idea pay to go. I fatogia pay to a fat. ฟอนด์ว่าเราคิดปุ่นอะไรก็น่าเห็นเรียกอาคุโอ้ยอุนิเวอร์ซิตี้ก็เอ็นดีอุนิเวอร์ซิตี้ก็เอ็นดีแล
Tafa was a tawe of a Uireva Christ University in Pacific. Na I pay ya when they are Pacific. We kai pe ko me pe itonga. Kai to ko ni pe o ma mo university. Kai pe a na pala. Kai to no ka wa ka pi. Ka wa ka ta pi ki a kala isi. Ko mala pe. Ko ya ko fa ka ta ma. Pe a ihe university o kala isi, the Christ University in Pacific. Mubai anahi aku angalalahi enima etaimin leafa Britania ko ngahi schools uluaki ko schools of Bible theology and apologetics aku angahonowa ko school of education. Akuanga Honotolu, ko School of Business and Law. Koyakoanga Honofa, ko School of Information Technology and Security. Koyakoanga Hononima, ko School of Science. Aya, utoy toy pe mo nga schools, keta na kimang. Kai owa ko kakato ang ngahi naunaw mo nga. Mga ngahi feitu ke pakaho ko kakato ay. Kai hitay mini, ito ko di ay eki, lelelele ipe. Kai maan mo ay afiona. Kwa kumay kihe ako ko eki. Kwa ngahi, Mata ito hi pe ko ay faka ilong ihe University of Kalaisi Pasiki kaya yung Kalasi ko foundation the foundation on na Victoria ne Osia o Form Six au kaya pe ke lang ay hataa ke na umay ihe Kalas ko ini o na Victoria ko ne lava e na Osi ihe Form Six Na ang mga doon lepe kita ulapi o ang ahi mata ito hi. Lepe ang mata ito hi ni AA, Diploma, Pechela, Masters with Thesis, mo ay PhD, Petota Philosophy. Ko ay ang ahi Thesis akaw Masters, tapi he kira kau tereta filosofa, bukan ahia memul. Angin kau tereta filosofa, ahia kau palofesa, kehe kehe itu hotel, mengahi universiti kehe kehe imul. Kiri kau ya, tu file bahu naufak eke eke, he kau tereta kehe ya itu, kerakai. Pag mo ani mo ani, ay may anane tohi kaya thesis. Kaya identify ay oral defense o ano may anak tohi. Kaya kapas ileva, kamahino ileva, uto kita. O kaya ay ano imano iya ay universidad ko hindi ihewa fika hafa. Ako kamay ay tangata ko ay ko Professor Meredes Warren Cusick pa may University Oakland University of Technology ko Professor Cusick ko iya ay talikita o ay PhD program ay University o Oakland Technology. Kaya ko iya pe, o kunihang ato ko na iya polo kalama masters, na mo polo kalama toketa filosofa ay Christ University in Pacific. Kaya ko iya ay honga iya, iya ay nga mo ipaw iya, confidence, 
ngai matai to him o o al he me to to nu pe he lai de aonga ke to ta ne fai ka ki he pe he ke so sai ne ti ka ko ya ai fi fi ala a mai pe ki a hon a ke nga fo ta ha pe pe mo e to ta ko e ni ne fo fo la ka ko ya pe fo ki ai chairman for a university fraternal society. Because friends of the university, because advisory council, because what the family at university say, I I don't talk to any. Now me me by come professor to go lucky. Now me at university get get immune. Now tell me I find my man I for two far cow cow. International Conference Ihe University of Kalaisi Aya ne ha ki ai ai ka palo fesa me me o mi ena nga hipeta la ka ton mo full toku me nga hi university ke ke o ma man o si vi ka na e hui ko no nga hi pare he nga hipepa ko e ka palo fesa e a be le ba ya o pa ki e le geno academic geno a nga hi university Ya fafeta kawai pe mo fanki matu a ai afion na fanki pe pa pa hua ki a ya to e fafe fa mo na to ke na konfirmis pe he ye mai fe du ke pe a to e ya mo fa kau kau ke to kwa tu pe fa ka ta ai konfirmis fa ba pe a na to e mo mo na university ke he to ko ni a pi to ya ki he Ako ama. Obia ipe fufu kachefia, eho afio kwa uhi. 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 Obia ipe fufu kachefia, Waikato University, the area of research. We shall have a commitment aki, a fetokoni aki, for university, the university, a Waikato, a tafa aki, or a research. Pakuma, a fetafila, a otua, faila mari, a koya, a fetau aki, a university, a la, a etu. Time to talk about the OCI MOU, the Amoy University, Major Republic of Europe, the Technical University of Ostrava. We have a Nalkama Fayako, the Fayako in Mahinanye Tom, the Nalkor Kalama Pe Anatom. Creative, Cybernetics and Robotics. Koetota koya kotomasi, ya kuneki henpe, masteisi koeni, wa more more kaike lava ukuaki ahodoki mua faka osi. Ka koe palesteni koe universiti koeni, na hui na ukeo na palesteni koe rekta. A ahima iya ke universiti Mahina Kosanwari. Toi wakai pe, toi ai pe mo ina unga hi kosi. Una toi loto ke fai. Ma ufa ta ta ofi pe nga hi kosi. Ma u loto pe ke fili fili pe, uak pe nga hi kosi. U kai ke maho pe pasiki. Nga hi kosi wa teknolosia. Ai to koni. Isi kakai ko fonua. Ma ufa isi anau mo ui. Langai pea tonga manakoa. Pea 
ini Foki mai Tuan Fahababau ia Mengat Kos ke ke Ikai ke ngatai Kupo Yang foki Mereka kau api Mereka universiti Korea Saudi Kupo Anun University Ya Bihari Ay Tuan Kupo Profesor Lee Resinia Profesor Ia Ay University Kupo Tuan Tuan Specialist Ia Ya Eria Kupo En Holok Profi Ya Kupo Neos Paralel Ia Mereka kau Parofesa Nau pos, ia tak posi, mui tak uni. Nau ni ame mui toko ua ki Korea, ko hoko atu pe, ia sai nisi, fo o ko e ni te ke fu ako e fe fe fa uia, ia pas fiki ka au ngan lahi au pito au pito. Ke kain ka tau pe, to yai mui ngahi universiti kehe, inu sila, mui ngahi fe itu ke, os kamata pe, Ai tala tala noa Pau ke ilere pe proses Kau ai pe ai universiti Oi pasifiki Ie konferenis Fra baha kureana koi na toki osi Ne hau ai fra fonga Makehe pe Oi universiti oi pasifiki Me weli na toni Koi fie tala noa Ke fe peha ha fe kau paki Ma moa universiti Ka moa universiti oi pasifiki Tu nga tai mini Kau kau fikir kau dalam doa aku pe, Paulo tu pe, yang kau ini adik ibu ke mengai sih kau ke, kau sih sih lele pe, ke obi angah mereka awak, ke tokoni, kau kakai fe unga mau tahu tu unga, mau etau lo tu, tahu tu otua, kau mau tahu pulang apa kau tu i, mau tahu tahu atai nak kau tahu kere kere. Wai lai lo tu pe o si si vi de le e na na fa u ko e ni mege na u o si ai ai le si ti lo tu pe na to wai ai fa mo le te na fa i pe ka fa i pe ai lo tu to ko i pe ai e ki e owa e ya ya fa hinga ka fa aki e fa i ka ma ka valea. I ka i ke ngai ka i. I he universit ko ni akalaisi Ang he afyo i he afyo na I ay fo ki ang ay me ako i ko e world views O ang ay siyo fakatafa aki Ki he universiti He na i ay paha o tuwa na ni nga aki He na i tupu pe i a te i a ta ang aki e a ta ha La i fo ngay universiti a ma mani O e world view ko e unaw ma u Kegiatan yang ah, kau itu putu pun, pe amamani, ah, tu bukoso pe ia, hovar pe ia, kau ke tu ipe he, kau tol kau kau kalistiani, kau tu itu kau tol, ne ia ia ot ia otua, angin kau tala atau itu aku, kau otua kau ia, ia itu no finangan. Ya ini kono alu kosi suka lais, nak hokum mai opekia, kato itu kau hi, ke awa ema, kita tol, efili, kofak aku uli, kata tau atai nama fia fia, kafak hokum nai kawin na ane afio imaman, imu apa tau hokat fia api, boleh hanga os teu teu, kaku ah, biar kai fia fia. Mahal fakta kamu nak siasi hitungan ini kafah aki kok ini ya ay kalau kalama ay universiti kui kui cepo saya ah kau tuh ape ini tah tah ini tah awa ya biaya kalau pehen ini kau tak kilo tu kamu lemon ya ngai kai miliar kamu ton kau kamai kui ubi Tak boleh ni, saya mana fikir fikir hidup ilah aku itu for weekend tak. Kalau sih dikau di universiti imasaya, fikir dia profesor mei asteria, profesor mei nusila, ramu nautol kau fafong mei tongani. Kau ha, saya awak aku tu hidup mak kalai si. Kau ha ha, fikir kau aku ya kalai si, dia mui fikir, fikir kau aku ya kalai si mui komputer. Kau ke? Tari kau nak orang ikan laut tolu, 
Con la hilo está en mini, tan fito es malo y con tecnología. Con la fumicini, pey. Con la fumicini, o que hay que naucar, naucar, que es COVID, o que hay que naucar, que es lele. Con todo el tajo, con el nefaga, ahora es fumicini. Hay human factor. Con todo el tajo, ahí es tener el fumicini que fa el COVID. Dan ere ei e fumisi ni ke fai lelei mo langa haki. Ne ongo ne matatao i he teknolosia. Ka uikai ke hatotaha ia o apasia o tua. Tene fra awa e ne matatao ke fra papomu. O tama te ia lau wafe ngai feitu. Rohinga ia pau ke kumai akalaisi ia. Po hiko i human factor. Tene hanga, mano e fumisi ni, a koe tangata, ke ngai pe tangata, ke iai akalaisi. Po hi kene fai hanga hi mea lelei mo aonga, ki he fonua mo i to tangata, ka tau tau te fito, ko tau ki fonua pere pere ngesi he universi. Fonua ko tonga, pere pere ngesi lahi au fito. Kau kai kita lo tu kita tu ke we inoa iya, ya fahinga ino be teknologi itu ko ini. Oh siang ni ko ini afio, ko iya ti ni afang tu ko ay universi, dan mo ni afang tu ko ay mea koto. Kai ke eho afio, mo ni mo ni ngai lo lo ay fahawa, ke afio ni ay fahinga pe ke fahamatala haki ko ngasi, ko e a nga ue a universiti ko e ni e a ko e whaka o si e o a fiu tutu uni e poa te kauko vana mo e lot of vela lot of pifia la i he pirifaki matai tohi o e tau kaha u wafe tahi vana Loto lele ilahi mo maafana lahi Poate ka uko wana mo universiti Ke faka hoko ke afion Uloa ki faka ilonga faka langi langi ae universiti Aia e faka hoko ia Koi tokta of divinity Koi tokta to hitaku Ma ae afiona Konga pe ia Koe Pie fia Honga ia Fayange, fayange! A tak mali he afiona a mo fare oha a mo he ofo. Tau pas pas o afeta! Eu mo afisio. Fatawane ke fakamonu ia Atwe tala monu, mwe tala tapu ati la au pito au pito. Omo afifio, omo fale. E fale tapu e krismasi, mwe tapu foko. E tulo ai pe, ai tuku fonua, omo fonua. Pe ake tuku loa foki, mwe fale. Fale, moe pôle, a fale, ha a mohe o fô, he fô nua po e ni, o tupu tupu a. Le vele, ma a fata po ha a, kau ta tau a. ตาหัวตาพอดีมันคุ้มเลยเราเข้าวัดตาพอดีเอาหิมะพอดีอ่ะไอ้เชื้อสเปเชียลเราได้นับตรงอ่ะมีตัวฟัวคุณเอาเข
nilifaki matangyo kwe ako eni kukuko mao kwe nilifaki matangyo hi ay Christ University in Pacific kwa moe diploma certificate ay lavena maalie Institute of Technology kwe omo institutions kwe ni ewa Kwa to os ni hoa fio Os Le si sita kwa pas kakato E eit minista Pea moe poate ti e ti wai pi Ke fwa ki matai to A si u pi Kwa e la hai ti Kwa i al fai ai Kwa le fi e matai mu an Ti hoa fio E ho la po e mo Kwa le mo le ala a fei taula lo ai a fiona a fwa pia ni mua a e lahi certificate diploma a e matato fwa ki maatua a e fine maatua lava de lei kuna lahi fei lahako a e wafe kaha vano a lo pao kumaile mo e tota e fai a e fwa hoko a e lawe a lo kore ke tau Pas pas kato a ke tamatui Could the following Red Wings with certificate in carpentry move forward The first is awarded to Reverend Donga Tifita from Haano Haapai, Honga, Holonga, Babako, Noko, Noko.
Certificate two in secretarial studies from the Bengali Institute of Technology. Ofa fifita alo leima to ababau baini folaha tongatapu nopo amaile kolpo.
University Uraki, Kosela, Tapua, Tangawapo, Certificate of Attainment in Mathematics Level 4, may have a lot of Tomatapu. Certificate in Media Arts, 
Pela minha vez, se a Nilva falou, falou bem com a rapaz, já está com o botão, mas fala uma pílula ali, muito mais rápido.
Congo, Meliane Elizabeth Stumpurotu, Diploma in Networking and Cybersecurity, from Malfana, Bailey, Colofo, Tomatapu, and San Francisco, USA. Diploma in Networking and Cybersecurity from Ofu, Faladeu, Wabau, Haatou, Pangai, Lifuka, Hapai, Pehezi, Lakepa, Kolofol, Tokomorono, Mataika, Tokatapu. Diploma in Networking and Cyber Security, a certificate in Creative and Cybernetics Robotics from the Technical University of Oslava, Peamei Pelehake, Alaki, Holonga Tomaga. Diploma in Networking and Cyber Security, the American Certificate in Marine Studies from the Shanghai Ocean University of China. The American Mahafana, Tomatapu, the Mulei Mahadua, Baba.
Mahata, Tarufa, Paya is the name I run. Petra of Commerce, major in accounting. From Utumake Babau, Ha Anno Felimea Hapai, Folaha, Habe Loto, Tomatapu. Christ University, Pacific, 
Pea rodonga ngawe foki i e University of Melbourne. Ko kone ta pas pas ta tante de India. I present the following candidate who are uh, to receive the awards from the Postgraduate Certificate and Diploma Programs. Mr. Sailosi Molakafa, Postgraduate Certificate in Theology from Tamafo'o, Maufanga, Tongatapu, now residing in Auckland, New Zealand. from Kwangun University in South Korea, from Lomamapu, Mavatu. from the Kwangwon University in South Korea, from Yuhifu Haapai, now residing in Tofoa, Lavegamaniye, Tongatapu. the following candidates who are to receive the awards from the master's program by research and Brian Professor Brian Cusick will read out the citation of each respective thesis. <coughs> Ms. Susana Nufo Daufa, Master in Theology, Second Class, First Division from Kolomotua, Koloma, Tongatapu. Each of these graduates have written a book entitled a thesis. Each thesis has gone to two independent international examiners. They've been examined offshore. Their results have come back in and they have been graded. And I've been asked to read a short excerpt from the abstract of the book that they've written. Our theology lecturer, Reverend Dr. Lipao Salada, who is also the Vice Chancellor of Christ University in Pacific, always has fond memories of the Wesleyan Christian missionaries. He sometimes talked about them during the lectures, especially Dr. Luton and Reverend Dr. Wood. He admired them in the way that they lifted up Tonga's education, Christian beliefs and music. So when I was about to choose my thesis topic, I decided to focus on one, the Reverend Dr. Harold Wood. 
As soon as I searched on the internet for Dr. Harold Wood, I found a very large number of references to his works and his life. I then interviewed people who knew his story. I traveled to Australia to interview his family, went to the libraries there, and searched through the historical records around his life. Mrs. Sokopetti Sinao, Masters in Education, Second Class, First Edition. From Koloa, Tauga, Neafukahi, Holoua, Ofu, from Vavau. Pangai Hapai, Katakamutonga, they are residing in Lamega Mali, Tongatapu. Study explored Christian school teachers' professional attitudes and development experiences. It used a mixed method multi case study approach that collected qualitative data from teacher focus groups and interviews and written reflections. The analysis showed themes and patterns in their professional processes, growth, and learning. Nine Christian schools and 30 teachers participated. The research found one important element that is missing and not always indicated in the general professional development of literature. It is the role of the teacher's Christian faith in guiding and inspire, inspiring professional and professional learning. Price, Masters of Forensic and Information Technology, Second Class, First Division. Du Bois Price also wins an award from a certificate from the Marine Studies from the University of Shanghai, Ocean University of China. She is from Abia, Samoa, Talao, Neyafu, Wawa'u, Tatakabotonga. Call for all Tongatapu. Citation. Much has been published on the requirements for a digital forensic laboratory, but a lot less on the requirements for a digital forensic laboratory manager. A manager is responsible for the selection and implementation of controls that ensure the consistent, timely, and reliable delivery of digital evidence to the relevant stakeholders. This research focuses on management, management requirements, and the documentation. The research fills a large gap in the current literature. is Mr. Osai Te Te Imoana, Masters of Forensic and Information Technology, first class honor. He is from Hato Hapai, Halau Furi Vavau, Hoba Kirikao Tongatapu. This study is designed to assess the current status of wireless network security in Nukalopo. The study has found that the analysis results indicate that the wireless area network usage in the capital of the Kingdom of Tonga has rapidly grown since the introduction of fiber optic networks. 
The research asked the question, what is the status of the wireless network security for the patients? The study has found that it is evident that the wireless network security is still in its early stages. The weak encryption method is still in use. The weak one, by the way. 24.2% had no encryption from the sample, and 9.2% did not change their security identities. Mr. Salis Itu'i Otumotula Lohopoi, Master of Cyber Security, First Class Honor. He is from Wafu to Alekivare Vavau. Daina Mwapaya, Tumua Hapai, Sila Pelua, Funga Manamba Uihade Otomataku. I, I know that also, Mr. Mr. Chancellor, that this is the first time that this degree of Master of Cyber Security has ever been awarded, uh, a valuable degree. Mm -hmm. The citation, this study focuses on designing a secure framework for e-government initiatives in Tonga, also identifying the factors that can be later become a vulnerability and a risk to the security of Tonga e-government. Data was collected through interviews with officials, document analysis and critical reflection on the theory context. Consequently, a security framework has been designed from the data analysis to protect the government initiatives. This study contributes a security framework for the use of developing countries to guide implementation of the government initiatives. Masters of Cyber Security, First Class Honor. He is from Funga Onetare, Logomapu Mavau, Moa Ode Hapai, Eweiki, Bea, Haveluloto, Tokatapu. In our modern era of information technologies, the exponential growth rate of cyber attacks on websites and databases are rapidly increasing day by day and night by night. Among all of them, sophisticated attacks are increasing drastically, which affects small and medium-sized companies and organizations. The purpose of this study is to review three low-interaction honeypots and to assess each in a network deployment. Suggestions for improvement for each deployment is made, and then a redesign and a new model of a honey block was constructed. This is easier to install, implement, create logs, and is useful in developing countries such as Tonga. Candidate from the master's program is Mr. Tevita Anitoni Tuikete Jr., Master of Philosophy in Theology. He is from Pangai, Tongareleka Hapai, Ereia, Malfaga, Halareva, Tongatapu. This thesis was entitled An Exploratory Study of How Tongans View Jesus. This research is aimed to collect ideas from Tongans about how they look at Jesus according to their own understanding. How they view him, think about him, and especially their knowledge. 
Information was collected as a personal response to the question Jesus asked his followers in Matthew 16, 13 to 17. But who do you say I am? The thesis presents these findings through reporting the statements and statistical analyzing the results from the many different perspectives that are found in the sum. It is a great honour to present two distinguished scholars who have successfully completed the requirements for the Doctor of Philosophy program by research. I present to you Mr. Maloni Mafire Okafa, Doctor of Philosophy. The thesis was entitled The Impact of the 1978 Separation in the Kingdom of Tonga. This year marks the 40th anniversary of the Paitakalao Christian Church. We have come a long way from the humble beginning of the church and have faced many challenges and hardships. But in all, we need to ask how this early movement impacted Tonga and the world end. Has it accomplished anything worthy of note, or was it just an insignificant movement? After 40 years, there are now thousands of members in the church and schools established throughout the islands, with its highest educational institute, Christ University of the Pacific. This thesis is an evaluation of the movement, the separations, and the fruit that has come. Mr. Siao Sipakola Mayakafa, Doctor of Philosophy, he is from Pangai, Kotu, Katou Hapai, Koloha, Kolofo, Kolomotoa, Tofoa, and now reciting in Lavega Mari Tongatapu. The thesis was entitled Governance, Management, and Control of Security Risk a socio-technical system design. This thesis is also accompanied by a number of publications and a top Australian university offer for a postdoctoral fellowship. Research into human factors in relation to technology use is a growing area of research that benefits the more effective and efficient uses of technology. In this research, the use of drones for traffic surveillance and conformance was studied as an innovative and a social technical problem solution. It was found that when the technical solution is managed with respect to users, an effective system for a traffic monitoring on the road is possible. The best solution was found to have a developed framework for information management and governance processes for the control of system risk. A working prototype was built to prove the theory is possible. Facitar, tampouco a plena que 
Terre, et puis tu peux arrondir vers la Ouga qui forme pas ce que tu as proclamé. Oui, mais on peut voir l'eau et la fleurie. On a cru que la fleurie n'y est pas de l'eau et la fleurie n'y est pas de l'eau. On ne peut pas parler que tout coupé, tu as oublié à la fleurie. Et tout coupé, c'est la fille, tu as oublié à la fleurie, mais pas de l'eau. Pas de l'eau. Pas de l'eau. Pas de l'eau. It is a very pleasant task for me to introduce today's guest speaker for this awarding ceremony from Bethlehem University. He has a PhD of education from Bethlehem University and former Vice President of Academic Affairs from Bethlehem University, USA. Please, round of applause for Dr. Kenneth Romain. Your Majesty, Your Majesty, Vice Chancellor Saulala, distinguished faculty and clergy, honored guests, 
ladies and gentlemen, and particularly graduates. Graduates, I am reasonably familiar with the rigor that you experienced earning your degrees, your diplomas, your certificates. And by history with this university, now a fully accredited university, you are receiving certification and recognition that's useful worldwide. And so I'm not going to give you a lecture on business management or leadership. What I want to do is take a little bit of time and talk to you, and it will be a little bit of time, but I want to talk to you to affirm what you've accomplished. And the way I want to do that is I want to refer to some wisdom that's come from, in this case, four very successful leaders in the Bible, one of them divine. First of all, I'd like to refer to the wisdom of Solomon. Hang on a minute. Gotta get my notes. One of the things a leader has to do is recognize, first of all, and this is a commitment I assign to you in this address, to recognize that you are leaders. You are effective leaders. And ladies and gentlemen, you are Christ centered leaders. And so let me give you a piece of Solomon's advice on your task of setting visions and goals and measuring progress in whatever you do. Solomon says in the 127th Psalm, first verse, unless the Lord builds the house, those who build it labor in vain. Unless the Lord guards the city, the guard keeps watch in vain. As a Christ-centered leader, whatever your endeavor, whatever your field, whoever is following you, whoever you serve, as you plan and develop, evaluate, and change, and move around in your leadership, you've got to understand that God has to be integral in that movement. If not, you will not bear fruit. Second piece of advice, this one from a divine leader, our Lord Jesus Christ. He was teaching his disciples, and let me just give a short background on this, because I think it's crucial. He was teaching his disciples the night before his death their last lesson. He was trying to give them everything they needed to know as a leader of a movement that would become a worldwide religious movement. Christianity. And he was trying to leave them with what they needed to sustain their leadership. Reading from the 15th chapter, the Gospel of John, first five verses. They have been read previously. Please let, them, let me read them again. Jesus is saying to his disciples, I am the true vine, and my Father is the vine grower. It removes every branch that bears no fruit. Every branch that bears fruit, he prunes to make it most, he, to make more fruit. You have already been cleansed by the word that I have spoken to you. Abide in me, and I abide in you. Just as the branch cannot bear fruit by itself unless it abides in the vine, neither can you unless you abide in me. I am the vine, you are the branches. Those who abide in me and I in them bear much fruit. Because apart from me, you can do nothing. I guess we're all familiar with vineyards. We in California seem to think California is the only place that grows grapes. And we know that's not true. But the analogy Jesus provides us and his disciples is that this vine has a root system and a trunk system. But to get to the grapes, branches have to be attached to the vine trunk. And as long as those branches are woven into that vine trunk, they bear great fruit. If they fall off of that vine, then they cannot bear fruit. And what Jesus is telling us as Christ-centered leaders is in our daily devotion, in our daily reading and prayer, in our daily work, we have to maintain 
a cognitive relationship and awareness that we are attached to that vine. And that everything that that vine gives us, we can take to those whom we serve as good fruit. Third person of wisdom is the Apostle Paul that I would like to, to draw from. One of the things that's essential in your leadership is you lead from the front. I think we've all had experiences with leaders who lead from the back. And after a while, as they're leading from the back, people start to tell them or think about them being told where to go and how to get there. By leading from the front, though, you lead by example. And you've got people following you. Unless they can maintain their role and their awareness of their relationship with the whole organization, it's not going to work. Paul experienced this with the churches he planted. He planted churches, as you know, all over the Roman Empire, the Greek, former Greek Empire, Asia Minor. He planted churches that began a worldwide faith. One of the problems he had to do, had to address every once in a while, is he had to write letters to these churches and visit these churches to remind them that each individual, and you need to be aware of this as you need people, each individual in the organization is a leader, has a very important role individually as well as collectively. And when they lose that integration of individual and collectivity, the organization gets weak. Paul writes to the uh, church in Corinth in 1 Corinthians uh, chapter 12, verses 14, and then 18 to 21. Paul speaking to Corinth. Indeed, the body does not consist of one member, but of many. But as it is, God arranged the members of the body. Each, of, each one of them he chose. If all were a single member, there would be, where would the body be? As it is, there are many members, yet one body. The eye cannot say to the hand, I do not need you, nor again the head to the feet, I have no need of you. What Paul is describing is something you probably have found or will find as a leader. It's one of the toughest jobs you've got. It's called personnel management. The key, though, is to keep everyone in the organization, including me, aware that if together we're attached in the vine, and the vine is in us, we can recognize our importance to the group and the group's importance to us. As a leader also, you will find that there will be times that are overwhelming. There are times that just are bad. And Elijah the prophet gives us some advice on that. Elijah had been waging a war, actually. A war between the worshipers of Baal and the worshipers of Jehovah. Elijah finished a great victory over the prophets of Baal. Made Jezebel, Ahab's wife, very angry. She ordered him to be killed and he had to run. He went all the way across the desert, ended up in a cave on Mount Horeb. And at that point, he told God he was in the last of his life. He could do no more. God told him the following. He said, go out and stand on the mountain before the Lord, before the Lord, for the Lord is about to pass by. Now there was a great wind, so strong that it was splitting mountains and breaking rocks in pieces. But the Lord was not in the wind. And after the wind, an earthquake. But the Lord was not in the earthquake. And after the earthquake, a fire. But the Lord was not in the fire. After the fire, the sound of sheer silence. Other versions say the sound of a still, small voice. When Elijah heard it, he wrapped his face in his mantle and went out and stood at the entrance of the cave. My point here is, you've got a solid vision. You're staying in contact with the vine constantly. People are working well. 
and things still can go bad. If we're willing to get through the wind and the fire and the earthquake, knowing that's not where God really is, and we're able to maintain our contact with the vine, we will find him in that still, small voice. And that's what establishes us, establishes your leadership, and keeps all of us Christ-centered. Let me share with you, in closing, some wisdom that I have to go to to remind myself of what I'm supposed to look like as a leader. Paul, writing from Rome to the church in Philippi, has a pretty good idea that he's going to be martyred. That the emperor didn't buy his arguments, he was going to be killed. And he was trying to leave things in order. And the church of Philippi was one of his closest churches. And he was trying to make them aware of their importance to people around them. And this is what he wrote to the church in Philippi. Reading from Philippians 4th chapter, verses 8 and 9. Finally, beloved, whatever is true, whatever is honorable, whatever is just, whatever is pure, whatever is pleasing, whatever is commendable, if there is any excellence, if there is anything worthy of praise, Think on these things. Micah, speaking to Israel, who at that point were desperate to find a way to make God understand they were good, he explained to the people, this is what you need to do. The Lord speaking through Micah. He just told you, O mortal, what is good, and what does the Lord require of you? But to do justice, to love kindness, to walk humbly with your God. And the final affirmation I'd like to leave you with. You are Christ-centered, effective leaders. Whether it's in a home, a community, an agency, a business, you are Christ-centered, effective leader, leaders. And as such, as you exercise truth, as you exercise honor and justice and integrity, you find admirable, admirable behavior. You find that you do justice. You love mercy. And you walk humbly with your God and Jesus, as that vine, will walk with you and before you. Again, I am very familiar with your accomplishment because I'm familiar with the rigor that you addressed to earn what you have earned. Please understand that we are very proud of you. And we pray that the Lord continue to hold you in the palm of his hand, keep you under the shelter of his wing, and grant you grace and peace and joy. Godspeed. Kita hope 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 kita Und es ist doch gleich, sie sind in sechs Tagen zusammen. Du hast heute die Lotte der Tau, die Hau, 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 die Tolo vai lá que fornoa. Oh, foi eu, é que se lima a tua. É que é mau coloa. Mau roto bem de tamanho de vani. Tá, 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 bem tão naqui. Pra tu, tá, que nem a tua, mas se te, que se a, alo mari, o toa, o rapai, o toquela. Anás, lo vai. Ane, pô, pra que lá vai ter o teu tenite. A se lima a tua, é que o pôr e a viri. É que o fornoa vai a nota maraca. Me apenas vai, Kemalut begitu tamai hebat ni. 
ke au mari ahoni la va fa na ko ni kuna o la ka mi fa le a tonga ki la ka mari ki fa no ki ti ahoni o alo mari fa ni e tu ko fa ma lo ki ta mai he mani wa na mo ku ni mo na tulo o i ba tu fa ma lo ki lo ta tau ki na yo ko a fi o fo ro a ki po ram ko ni o ko la vi ko a fi o tu i ha po ka ma ko mi ko beta Kwe aho ni kwe aho ni ke hoa e tol, o ke a kio ke a tuko, ko o e fa ka mo le mo le a tuko, kwe a tu ngai ka ri puri a ka le si si ta ri le si ti, ka i ke ma to i ri ma to i ngata a ka i fi fi a, ka kwe a tu ngai a fo fo o, ka kwe fa ma lo a kwe ho fi o, ko a fi o fo lo a i he ni, kwe ta u ni kwe ta u fa a no a yes a si, to ka i ko lo. Foto ko ko isla ka mari ni foto e ngai ko ni mai loe ka lo ki ako ko ngai la lo akau. E mano ki mo ka tak na to lo o wi ko ki ni lau ko fa ka saat pate. Ko hi ko ni pe na na fa fa ko hi ba fa ka lo tu pe mo lau to hitap. Ko e ako ni te ma fa na ko ki lau to fa ka saat pate ko ho ko ko e fo fo ni ve si ti a to nga ko le si ta i to. Da ka no ni a ki ko e tak ki ni ve si ti ko ya ko e to i o to. Ko hai le ta si si a, ko tum tum mo ni ka to ngai ta fa no ta kai kolo, e ho ko ko a tu ya, ke ngai wi ta ho ko mai, ta mi ta hi ma fi ta walu ke a ho ni, a ta walu ti se ma wa ke ta walu, ko a fi o a tu yo tu tonga, e ke ke yo la bena mai, ko ko le ta pas pas, ta ma o ke ti, ti la ko ti le, a ni a fi o. Ko fa ma lo ki ka ta ki lo to, ka ta fa to i, mo to fa ta ha, mo ko ko ki in vesi ka ta i si. Ka ki ta ulau ma ba ka, ki ko ta ulo to ki to ko ta ha pi, ki to ko ta ha pi ka ma langa i, ka ko ko lo a i a, ma ko lo a i a, ki ta to fa ta ha, ko ta ulo vesi te, ka ko fa ma lo ka ta ki lo to, ta si ki ma rere. Fa ma lo ki ta ko, ko na po pe in spani. Fit pamalo kem nista mi keki ono apo waste pamalo kem nista inteno afia ono apo kosarini pas heke kau tak yu kuri anga mo ula pamai aho koen aho en komoen yu ngo ori be siasi mo kuri anga kat malo hiya fonua kota opopo ke visione tamatui kot me apo ko langa fonua ko langa fonua ko yai kuro ko pamalo foki Ke fafong falere niwa pa tau, e ke minista pa ka malo, dokta isa ke, e ke se a kau tari kita ngai ako, pa te kau dokta mele ana ploka, ta te mita pao ke kau sektoa tau taha, pa malo he tau tu fa taha, nia ngai si si he tau ki fonua, fo i pi liot he kolope, ka ta ka ka taha pe tau fo he, ki tau ki hoko pe ko si wele pa si, ke fa malo ke kau hiba. Tapi kau bisa tahu pun, mau kau hibas asyik sejarah atau apa? Kau wifi, kau polisi, mufa mari, mufaram lagi, kau tahu nak kau ini. Kau mufa maru, saya setuju kau bolo, kau bolo tu mufa baga, kau lawan leri, lagi invest leri tu baik baik kau ini. Kau lawan kau itu hi, kau ngau leri, kau adu ngau lah hebat kita hebat. Kau kau maru tu, kau kau bolo. On behalf of the chancellor, board, staff and class. 2018. I extend sincerely appreciation to you, Dr. Ramain, guest of honor, for traveling from San Francisco, United States, to inspire our graduates and all of us of the core value of a good leadership. May your message motivate our young men and women to become good leaders families, communities, and country. And may you have enjoyed your time in the Friendly Islands. We owe so much of the day's success to Professor Emeritus Brian Dusek, Professor Lee, Professor Steve Kumar, Dr. Ben Takao, Associate Professor Raymond Lutui, and the members of the University Fraternity Society that could not be here in person but in spirit. 
We cannot quantify the blessings we have brought the CUP. Please allow me to conclude my vote of thanks by wishing Your Majesty King the Bold VI and Queen Alaspao a Christmas that is blessed beyond compare and a new year of full promise, vision and new beginnings. May God bless Your Majesties and God bless all of us in an auspicious occasion to offer.
loving Father, into thy presence we come, not by the works we have done, but by your grace and grace alone. We have come to the conclusion of this joyful and most blessed graduation ceremony. Today we are rejoicing over the successful achievements of the graduates of Christ University in Pacific and the Lenomari Institute of Technology of 2018. It has been a great gift from you God and graduates we are able to learn from experts and lecturers in their chosen field and that they are now prepared to give up themselves in service in the realms of the academic world. In Bible, apologetic and theology, education, business and law, information and technology, science, commentary, secretarial studies, and many others that we are going to witness in the future. May the skills that graduates have developed in managing their time, setting priorities and keeping focus, which led to this joyful location, be the foundation on which they build successful careers and lives. Our greatest prayer for them today is that they continue to be lifelong learners who recognize their need to constantly discover more about you, a source of all knowledge and truth. Help them to be diligent in their quest to know you and to discover how to want to, how you want them to live. May you fill our graduates with gratitude, humility, love and faith. Teach them how to pray. Give them spiritual wisdom and discernment. Give them the wisdom and courage to say no to the temptation, to put self and things at the center of their lives. Send them strong Christian friends and spouses. Teach them the choice of service and generosity. Give them close to their families and open the wisdom of their elders. Help them learn from their mistakes and failures. Show them where to go for help when they need it. May your incomparable blessings and the joy and the most wonderful gift of Christmas be always upon the guest of honor, the King of Tonga, His Majesty King Tupouono, also the Chancellor of Christ, University in Pacific, and the beloved Queen, Queen Anaspau. We also pray that your, that your blessings be always upon the nobles of the realms, Prime Minister, Ministers of the Cabinet, members of the diplomatic corps, and the rest of the distinguished guests. May your blessing be also upon Professor Emeritus Brian Kusek and all the rest of the professors and lecturers of the university, the Vice Chancellor, Reverend Dr. Alifa Wailea Savlara, and the guest speaker with the important and most relevant message to the great weeks. Dr. Kenneth Romines and the rest of the staff of the university, church leaders and the rest of the members of Glechi, parents, relatives and friends, and especially the graduates of 2018. We are aware that as we pray, our graduates feel into, into your hands. We are placing the future of your world and your kingdom into their heads. Thank you for bringing us 
to this wonderful day. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Amen. May the Lord bless us and keep us. May the Lord make his face to shine upon us and be gracious to you, to us. May the Lord lift up his countenance upon us and give us peace. Now to him is able to do immeasurable more than all we ask or imagine. According to his power that is at work within us. To Christ Jesus be always the glory. And the love of God, the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, to be upon us now and forevermore. Amen. Amen.